Hey y'all, welcome back to The Pink Envelope. It's November, I cannot believe we're already filming the November haul. And you know what? It's a biggie. Like, you wanna go make a drink. Well, I don't know when you're watching it, grab a wine, a coffee, a Diet Coke, I don't know. We have a lot of really, really cool boxes. Some of our tried and trues, and then several brand new and I did some shopping on decor still, so I wanna show you an item. And I've got two empties reviews, meaning products that have come in a subscription box that I want to loop back and chat about some more. So if you are brand new here, welcome. We're so glad you're here. How this works is I quickly unbox a box, pointing out some highlights, showing you some of the items. If you like what you're seeing, you're gonna go down to that description below. There is a URL and all the information you need about that box to learn more, go ahead and subscribe. Price, shipping, coupon codes, everything is down below. Use that as your resource as I won't have a lot of time to deep dive into all 12 plus boxes I have stacked right here. Also, the holiday gift guide is live. So if you're doing some shopping and you just want some direction for him, for her, food and beverage, like people who love to like mix cocktails or cook fun things. We've got pets, we've got kids, we've got family, we've got a lot of things. You can go check out the holiday gift guide. I do have that link up top down below in the description. You can take a peek at it on our new website. It is launched. It is not done. I am working in between everything. We're like totally in vlogmas right now where we are releasing typically three times a week. Uh, is what we normally do, releasing five or six right now. It's wonderful, but slowing me down on the building out of the website because we are doing it personally. So crazy. Such a proud moment though. Tell me what you think about it. Um, you can join the Ask the Pink Envelope private Facebook group if you wanna hop over there and hang with us. We're chatting about the website, ins and outs of subscriptions, all the things. All right, I need to hush. We need to dive in or we're gonna be here all day. I did make a list so that I would stay focused. Let's go here first. Dogmong Lifestyles. So we've opened this box a few different times. Every single box is awesome. This is a dog in dog mom subscription box. This box is monthly at $49.99 or $69.99. They have two options. I think the second option, you get the dog mom t-shirt. Uh, they do ship to US, UK, and Canada. Rates are below and use coupon code PINK to get $10 off your first box. And Dog Mom Lifestyles was created to help moms and their pups low stress, rejuvenate, enjoy an enriching experience. I do know that they give back, which I love. So I'm trying to see if this is a spoiler before I turn it towards y'all. It's the fall box. So maybe, maybe a spoiler, I don't know. Three year anniversary fall box. We have this little welcome here and everything that is inside here. I'm not gonna look because I love being surprised right alongside y'all. I think this is the pup and organization that they are giving money to this season with this box. That is one of the things that is really cool that a lot of these boxes do give back in big ways to different nonprofits. So like this one, dog box, dog, dog nonprofit. Well, this guy on top is super cute. Also, extraordinarily soft. Okay, so y'all see him here. We're gonna do the test. Don't know if you wanna turn your volume down, but his booty does squeak. He has a squeaker in there. This is so Cute. I feel like dog toys sometimes are cuter than kids' toys. That is great. Ooh, candles. I love candles because we have too many dogs. That is very, very, very cute. Let me see if I can smell it. Oh, yeah. Definitely oh, says it on top. Woo! Well, that did say French vanilla on it. It's a French vanilla candle. It does have three wicks and it smells super, super good. Ooh, steamy rose scented self warming steam eye mask. I love mask, especially eye mask. Eye mask truly force you to relax because you have to just sit there with your eyes closed. I love doing them right before bedtime because then you can just fall asleep right after. Dog lover, a day without a dog is a day without the sun. The love for my companion keeps me floating in the skies. Feels so good to give a treat. I'd be all but lost without the creature at my feet. 
very, very cute. We got some home decor. What? Cairo glam ice globes. Is that those things you put on your eye? I've never tried these, but I've always wanted to. They are, that's exactly what they are. Okay, so you get these cold and then you lay them on your eyes. A, I love that they're a pink sparkle. That is so appropriately me. It does say you can apply a facial serum or oil. Love. Put one globe for each side of the face. Oh my gosh, you can roll them. You can do all sorts of things. So I've seen these and I'm one of those people who if I cry before I go to sleep, when I wake up the next day, my face will be swollen shut. It is crazy. So I can't watch anything like overly sappy or overly sad or overly romantic like uh, on books or TV. Cause then if I go to bed with my eyes puffy, ugh. so I've always wondered if these would help. If I could massage all around and let them sit on my eyes if it would de-puff before going to bed. I'm gonna try it. Oh, we have soft, chewy, all natural treats for your pup. I feel like she always sends an all natural treat in each one. And I don't know the exact count, let me make sure I'm not missing anything here. But I feel like she always does a really good mix of pup and mom. So in this box, we got six items for $49.99 of which some of these, like this is reusable, this is way reusable. These are consumable, but some of them last longer than others. These are reusable. A good balance of stuff that isn't gonna stack up in your home, but that can be enjoyed by both you and your pup. And of course, if you ever get something that you don't love, start that box now for Christmas presents because you could have like the ultimate, save everything. Save the tissue, save the crinkle paper, set aside items you may not be wanting to use for your home or maybe somebody popped into your mind that you're like, oh my gosh, this would be perfect for them. Start building out those gifts now and Christmas will roll around, you'll be completely set. Okay, this second box is brand new to the channel and I wanna show it to you. It also was requested a couple of times on the Pink Envelope private Facebook group. You can join that. I do have the link to that group down below. It's where we hang out and talk about subscription boxes, what we love, what we don't love. You can ask for recommendations. Uh, I share insider tips and tricks. I share insider coupon codes there as well. So if you do join that group, our only rules are that you're really loving and kind and fun because everybody in there is really loving, kind and fun. Okay, Thrive Remotely by Happy Home Office is a monthly subscription. They also have two box options, $45 and I think $58. You can use the code PINK15 to get 15% off your first box. And Happy Home Office was created to deliver inspiration, community, and self-care to the busy work from home mom. That is definitely me. All right, on top, oh, I have a handwritten note. And then we have the Thrive Remotely magazine here on top. Let me sleek over, oh, this is a spoiler. This is the November, 2023. So you have to order it in the month of October. What is today? Yep, not getting this one. <laughs> Normally I release my monthly hauls in the first, like I always release monthly hauls in the first. Uh, I'm a little bit behind. I'm just gonna be real honest. This has been wildly wonderful, but we've been so busy that I'm getting it out on the third, which is fine. It's just as good. And I normally don't release on Wednesdays. So I think initially I was like, I can't release then. Anyhow, this box is gonna be a great example of what you can expect to receive in your box moving forward. On the second paper here is a November checklist of things to hold yourself accountable during the busy month of Thanksgiving. Oh, it smells really good in here. So on top we have a Rise and Thrive. Is it a like a cup holder? Yeah, it looks like a drink holder. Like, you know, what am I trying to say? Why am I, my brain is not allowing me to say this? Put it down and you put your drink on a coaster. There we go. It's just slowly, we're slowly getting there. We have a set of note cards. One, two, three, four, five note cards in what seems to be two different prints and there are envelopes in here. energy bar and chocolate chip banana bread. That sounds delightful. And these work, y'all. These are super good. Okay, I'm like, where do I wanna grab next? 
Here's a little easel. I don't know what the little easel is going to be used for. So I'm just going to put that like that because that looks really cute and would be a great thing to have on your office desk. This is what smells so good. The Perfectly Soy Candle Autumn Harvest uh, Wax Melts. So there are six of them here. I wonder if this is a wax melt thing. I got my very first uh, wax melt thing in my red box of mental wellness. I just opened that one this last Sunday. You can go check it out up here. Um, really cool box focusing on me mental wellness right before the holidays. So I feel excited because normally I wouldn't be able to use those. Oh yeah, okay, so if you don't have a wax melt thing, she also included a candle with a lid. So what you would do is burn this candle all the way down. And then when this is done burning, you can just buy like this little round base that you plug into the wall and it's a warmer. You could put your candle on top of there and start dropping these in there. That's normally what I do. I haven't owned a wax melt thing, so I just did that process right there and it's always worked. Um, and they're the same scent, so it really worked. It smells exactly like if you go into Kirkland's and you smell autumn harvest. It's like the perfect, it's like smelling this is bringing back so much nostalgia. I'm really big on anything you're doing, like this is a mindset of gratitude book. If I'm gonna sit down and do this, I, A, as a millennial, will have a drink in hand, because heaven forbid, I don't always have a drink in hand. B, have to have a scent. I burn candles every single day. And then sounds, I do like music as well. I play music pretty often. So this is actually a gratitude journal with prompts. So it shows it here, but let me flip the page over to here. It kind of shows you the diversity in the book. What a great time to get this because honestly, we're gonna power through this holiday season and we're gonna pop up on the other side in January and be like, what just happened? You could start now if you have time, I do not. But come January, I want this sitting ready and waiting so I start my year fresh with a good mindset uh, and a little bit of gratitude would, <laughs> would take me a long way. Uh, we have a pen inside in the book, Remote Ink, How to Thrive at Work Wherever You Are. I should read this. This would be so good for me. Retail value on the book is $29.99. So $30 alone resides in this book here. So if you are a work from home person, it said mom on the bio. So maybe some of the items are a little more mom specific. Um, but if you are a female work from home, I mean, this, this is very universally female work from home. Great quality, smells good, looks pretty. And I'm guessing I did this right. I have worked from home for since 2000. Eight. Is that right? I think I've worked from home since 2008. Maybe like actually like 2007, 2008, it was a hybrid. I was working part from home and part in an office. And then by the end of 2008, moving into 2009, I was fully work from home and I have been ever since. I haven't had a real job in 15 years. And so I'm obviously a really big advocate and fan of stuff like this because it really does help. It can be very lonely and very isolating if you don't figure out how to have community and you have to figure it out all on your own. And things like this really do work. It plugs you in, they have Facebook groups and community on that side, plus you get the products, so you have a common aspect besides being entrepreneurs. It's fun. I really do super love opening new boxes like that because it just kind of shows me, A, how cool people are and B, the cool stuff coming our way. This next box here has been super, super highly requested on Ask the Pink Envelope. So I just got on and ordered it. Uh, special delivery from Taste of Home. I do not have a coupon code. I don't have a link. I, I have been emailing them like crazy. So if any of you have a tip or trick to get a hold of them, I would love to talk with them more, but that's been impossible. So I ordered it. We're gonna play with it and see if it's worth its snuff. It is a quarterly subscription at $44.95. Uh, digging around, I believe if you go down to that URL I have linked below, if you click that URL, 
I think it will give you $10 off your first box plus free shipping. You guys can loop back and let me know if that is true. But every season, their test kitchen pros put their favorite recipes, cooking gadgets, kitchen products into the box. You can easily try best love recipes and exciting new brands with confidence, receive six to seven well loved products. I've heard mixed reviews on this one. So I thought we need to get it in our hands and see what we think. At $44.95 a quarter, that's very affordable. That's only four times a year, under $50. Okay, this is info on the fall box. So this could potentially be a spoiler. So heads up, I don't know when they start and stop shipping. Here's the information here. I see an envelope on top. Is this our recipes? Yeah, okay, we have a recipe for Basic homemade bread, vegetable and beef, stuffed red peppers, deviled eggs. Okay, we're just gonna take a moment right here. I can't figure out deviled eggs. I've been trying and I can't figure it out. So I'm gonna test this puppy because I've been trying based on like Pinterest stuff and it was a no-go and I'll let you guys know. A skillet steak supper, pina colada icebox cake. I love icebox cake. A breakfast quiche, quick and easy strawberry jam. And this is what the cards look like on the front and what they look like on the back. Um, I don't know if they have a book or not. I have a book. When I have a recipe, drink, or food that I like, I slide it in there or I transfer it to a cookbook. Uh, something to think about, because I mean, you'd have to have a system for organizing these and keeping the ones you like and passing on or getting rid of the ones you don't. Uh, very appropriate. There is an egg separator in here. I actually would never purchase this. Like it just isn't something I would go out and buy but I think it'd be something that's beneficial for my kids and showing them how to do it. So yeah, I'm, I'm a fan of that guy right there. My youngest loves to cook too. What is this? An herb saver triples the life of your herbs. Oh my gosh, my herbs never last. So here are the ones they're saying, and it says keep bought or fresh grown herbs for up to three weeks. It says you put water in the bottom and you refresh the water every three to five days, like that picture right there. So literally you're just kind of like growing a plant. I guess if you left it there long enough, you could grow a plant. A knife sharpener. That's a pretty practical item. Cool. Uh, let me look at the quality. That I can feel and see. I wanna open it, look. Knife sharpeners can be iffy. I ran out of batteries. Okay, where was I? No, I was on this guy. The Zule Kitchen. Uh, I mean, it feels good. You know how sometimes when you touch this stuff, you're like, oh, it's plasticky and cheap. No, it, it's metal and it has a coarse. This one's labeled coarse and this one's labeled fine. So it has two different sharpeners. I don't know what this does, and if Jonathan were available, he could come tell us, because he normally does this, but, I mean, it looks good to me. Taste of Homes Silicone Basting pa Pastry Brush. Yes, please, I only have one of these. And the head is, like, the, the stick plugs into the head, and it broke off forever ago. So when you're using it, you can't, like, whip, because it would just fly off. So you have to, like, kind of, like, press it in, keep it against the edge of the bowl. You have to press it against the roll and butter it with the acknowledgement at any point the head may fall off. So why I haven't replaced that, I'm now sitting here with you guys, I'm, <laughs> I don't know. But now I don't have to worry about it. Oh, two things. A silicone spoon rest in red, so it's very holiday appropriate. Also, it has these on the bottom so it doesn't sit in suction. And when you lift it up, this comes with it. It ideally, should stay on the counter. And then we have tongs, tong, what does that say? <laughs> what do these do? Pick up baby cookies, all I know, look at the, look at them. They're Santa's mittens, which is super, super cute. Helping hands to serve holidays this season. I guess it's just a little baby serving thing. That is really cute. My kids are going to love that. You know what I've learned about subscription boxes? Right, you get some stuff and sometimes you look at it and you're like, what am I ever gonna do with that? And that's when I immediately put in the box to give to others. And then there's other things like this and this that I would not have bought. I would have never even thought to bought, buy these. But I would be willing to wager that they become items that get used in my kitchen 
all the time. You don't know what you don't know type thing and subscription boxes are good at helping you see that. My kids are gonna be very excited and John's gonna be very excited about that. And then at the bottom, there is a whole cookbook. The Taste of Home Blue Ribbon Winners. Then this means this thing is filled with the best recipes. And it does have a little bit of everything. Oh my gosh, the pictures are so cute. Let me flip back, hold on. So these are the people who won and it's their recipes. I love this so much more already. Heartwarming photos and stories, memories from fairs around the country, 275 prize winning snacks, main courses, pies, cakes, and more. This is my type of good old Southern cooking. Oh my gosh. I love it. Okay, well, I mean, I wonder what the retail value on this book alone. Does it say it on here? It doesn't. Well, hold on. We're going to look this up. Okay. Uh, it has a 4.6 out of 5 stars, so obviously it's a dang good cookbook. It has a retail value of $20 on Amazon, but it says it's on sale for $11.49, so we'll go with $11.49. So we have 12 bucks on the cookbook alone, and the whole box is only $45. Got this plus these additional recipes for that. I'm impressed. I think this is a good value. I think these are very applicable products and I think they're products that if you don't use them for some reason, like maybe you won't use this, I could give this to my sister or mom and they both would be super excited. So on first impression, I'm giving it a thumbs up. If you subscribe to this box, will you go down below and comment and let us know what your thoughts are. With just one box, it's kind of hard to see, but if you've had several boxes, you'll be able to lean in and tell us more. And if there's anything I didn't share here that we should know, like is there a way to customize or whatever type of information, make sure you put that down below so anybody looking to gift this to someone or to subscribe for themselves can read through that and get those helpful tips. Okay, number four. Oh, number four. I'm excited about number four. Okay, we gotta get, ugh, I gotta go over here because I've got to walk it <laughs> over to my desk. I ordered a still from Decor Stills, but this is not one of the ones, or I mean, I'm still so new on that side of things. I do their steal it box religiously. Um, when does that release compared to today? Oh, it's releasing in just a couple of days. So if you have not already subscribed to the channel, I am spoiling the decor steel still at box for winter. But uh, I went and got out of their shop this item. So meaning that it's available right now. It's not one of those things that if you miss the steel, you can't get it type thing. It is available. And so if you've been on my channel, you know that this is a pain point. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know this is a pain point for me. It happened to me last year and it happened to me again this year. I love to get an anchor piece when I'm decorating, whether it be a wreath or a sign. I love cute signs. Um, whatever it may be. And then once I get that piece, I kind of start decorating around it. Well, I went to all of my same stores, Michael's, Hobby Lobby. Um, I went to places like Home Depot and Lowe's, Kirkland's, um, At Home. I went to them all, it felt like. Joann's and walked out and was like, it's the same stuff from like the last two to three years at least. And I wasn't interested in it. And that's when I got on the decor still shop. A, nothing was the same old stuff, lots of new stuff, but like not just new stuff, really cute, unique designs. So I bought my anchor piece for my fireplace. I haven't even looked at it. We're looking at it together today for the first time. I bought this sleigh ride sign. I think it is fabulous. I like signs that are big and statemental and like, you know, really, really create and set a scene that everything else you add to it plays with that scene. Um, I do know what is in the decor still still up box because it's a re-release box. And I, so it was easy to order this because I was like, oh. These are gonna play really well together. Also very affordable. This sign was $49.99 with $5 shipping. Very, very affordable. I don't know the measurements, I can put them down below, but it is so cute. 
I'm gonna hang it on the fireplace. It does have two hooks here on the back. I'll probably put a center one and hang it once, or I may just lean it up against. So if you are looking for cute, unique, new stuff, I, I keep hearing amazing things from the decor stills shopping side. Uh, we have in the Ask the Pink Envelope private Facebook group, one of you that posted, oh my gosh, I ordered this furniture piece, like a full out cabinet for a couple hundred dollars, I think. And you gave it a huge thumbs up. And two other people immediately got on and said, I ordered that cabinet and I also give it a thumbs up. So these are reviews by multiple people. I'm sure not everything's great, but I'm gonna try to piece through things, find pieces that I love, get them in so we can test them and I'll let you know whether they're worth it or not. And this guy is. You can use the link down below to go do some shopping. I don't have a coupon code or anything, but that URL down below will take you straight to the sign. And then from there, you can keep scrolling and see a lot of other light items. My first official regular decor stills item. Okay, Healthy Me Living. It has been um, like a year, I think, since we've opened Healthy Me Living. Healthy Me Living is a clean sl snack subscription. So I love it because of my, I've got st <laughs> styrofoam everywhere. Okay. Because of my clean eating, I look for things that are on the go easy, but are still like non-GMO, no high fructose corn syrup, natural ingredients if possible, but definitely no added things that will make my tummy sick. And so this box is monthly at $32.99, free shipping to the US and Canada. If you use code TPE15, you get 15% off your first box. And this is a snack subscription for busy moms, busy health nuts, and picky eaters. These snacks have no artificial ingredients. They're made with healthy ingredients that enhance the nutritional benefits. No, no high fructose corn syrup. Everything's natural and organically sourced. There are no GMOs, no trans fats, like really all the good things that you should be eating. All right, when you open it like this, it has a cute presentation. So if you're gifting it, it is giftable. And then let me just kind of share with you what comes in this box. Not all of them are the same, but this will give you a good idea. There is a Woe Dough Sprinkle Sugar Cookie Dough Bar. This will not make it through the day. These are delicious and I love them. And I don't order them and keep them in the house because I can't control myself. I will eat them all. These are Bubba's Fine Foods Sweet Glaze Keto Nut Mix. Oh my gosh, I love glazed nuts. Another great one. Bought a bean, bought a boom, sweet onion and mustard snack. I can't do mustard. Y'all, I think it's so gross. Although I wish I didn't think it was gross. Like genuinely in my heart, I don't want to feel that way. But Jonathan loved it. So him or Paige will dive in and eat that. Oh, we love these. These are so good. Make good crispy strawberry squares. So basically a healthy Rice Krispie treat. These are so good. A toasty almond blueberry bar. These are so good. Maxine's Heavenlies. An oatmeal cinnamon raisin super soft cookie. I have not tried these. Those sound delicious. I think that's like, this is gluten free. Yeah, that's gluten free. That one is for sure gluten free. The chickpea chips. Never had these, but I am a chickpea fan. And then the Lesser Evil Popcorn in Himalayan Pink Sing Salt, another family favorite around here at the Pink Envelope. So what I love about these is I wouldn't even know where to start to try to source these different things. So what I do is the box comes in, I try these. The ones I don't like, obviously, whatever, I just get rid of them. But that is how I discovered that I like these. When I find the things that I like, then I hop online and see where I can order more. Amazon, Costco, Sam's Club, H-E-B, Walmart, wherever. But if I were responsible to drive around, try to find these, purchase a big box of them, bring them back and not be stuck with a bunch of excess, it just wouldn't happen, it wouldn't work out. So these boxes like this are excellent because you know what I mean? How are you gonna be able to spend all the time to dig through ingredients to find that they don't have high fructose corn syrup, that they don't have GMOs, that they don't have trans fat, 
but also that they are natural, organic, using healthy ingredients. Hey, nobody got that amount of time. So leave it up to Healthy Me Living, support a small business, and get delicious snacks that you can reorder and reorder and reorder at your leisure. Okay, let's do, oh, Lorella sent us another box. So we did this really cool haul on best of beauty subscriptions. So I ordered a bunch of beauty subscription boxes. And then the ones that were the best, I kept and put into a video. Well, this is one of them. And they sent another box without even me asking, requesting or anything. So I just want to pull it out and play with it. I feel like when we can open a box more than once, it really gives us the ability to get a better understanding if that box is a match for us. Not every subscription box is for everyone, but there is a subscription box for everyone. And we're here to help you find the ones that are your best match, the ones that save you time, the ones that save you money, and the ones that spark joy in your life. The Lorella Fam subscription box is monthly. They have three box options. Oh, I clearly didn't finish cutting the tape. That start at $19.99 and go up to $29.99. So when I say it's affordable, it's very affordable. Uh, let's see, free shipping in the US. Use code TPE to get 10% off your box. And the $19.99 and the $21 boxes are lash subscriptions. And then the $29.99 option is a full box and you get five to seven full size items and, ex and you do get um, access to their exclusive makeup palettes. I've only ever used one, but the one that I used, I really like. Okay, October box, we're not spoiling anything. This is what's in my big box and the new products that are coming out when they launch new products, subscribers get first access to them so you don't have to worry about them selling out before you can even get to it. Ah, oh, I love the colors. Let me just tilt this like this. Can y'all see all the colors in here? It's very, very happy. So what do we have here on top? I'm gonna go fast, otherwise we'll be here all day on just this box because it is so much fun. But there are three Lurella headbands, pink, nude, and black. Oh yeah, they're just like the thick ribbed headband. Very, very cute. So there's three different ones there. That's actually really soft on here. We got, oh, please be labeled. I don't know how to tell which brushes are what. It's so sad. The LC29 and the LC35. I wonder if there is a way, LC, is that like crease, lower crease, lower? <laughs> I don't know. Is there like a catalog somewhere that tells you what these are? Cause I have to be told or I won't know. But I mean, it's a good basic brush. It's not overly luxe, but it isn't cheap. It's a good middle ground brush. So there's two of those there. That is the palette, you guys. This is the coolest palette I've ever seen. I am all about a good theme, obviously. I decorate for every holiday. My house looks like Halloween grew up in it. Uh, I decorate myself. I'm like all the t-shirts for every holiday. I love doing crazy makeup for any occasion. The Pick Your Poison palette. So this side has a mirror on it. They magnetically close together. And then these are excellent colors like poisonous and venomous and harmful and lethal are the eyeshadow, eyeshadow colors. And then at the bottom there's pressed pigment. So there's two different things on this one palette. I freaking love these colors. I do not own any red even remotely close to this red here. And my daughter, my oldest has like a full mask she's wearing, but my youngest um, is a, a zombie cheerleader, I think is what she's calling herself. So I think we'll be able to use these for her costume. Oh, y'all are gonna see this afterwards. Of course, I'm opening this before Halloween. Halloween's tomorrow, in fact. Um, so that's why I keep referencing Halloween. Oh, an orange travel tote in this guy here, a black paddle brush. So I got one of these in my last one. <laughs> this says love is in the hair. Uh, the girls have been using it. It's been great. So I've been using it consistently with two girls uh, for a, a over a month, a month and a half at this point. And it's great, just like a normal paddle brush. So I give it a thumbs up as far as use. Lip liner, 
in the color toffee. Not going to open it because we don't have enough time. Y'all, not opening and playing with these products may be the death of me. <sighs> okay, we will do this. So in the $29.99 subscription box, like the box box, the palette, the two individual brushes, oh, the tote, and the brush. So this is all items that come in that $29.99. These are brand new products that are launching that you should know about. The makeup headbands are only $3 each. These are $3 each. Everything that they do is extremely affordable and you can add them onto your box. So those are new launch products. I've got to get it organized because I'm about to pull out like, well, my hand's not big enough. I'll have to grab it with two hands. Lashes. These are all eyelashes. So. The 3D mink eyelashes come in here. Okay, it's these right here. 3D mink eyelashes in hot fire. Can y'all see those lashes? They are so, so much. These we'll look at in a minute, but this shows you like, you can see the different colors of boxes. They have an endless number of lashes and they all have like great names. Like that was hot fire. This is Wander, Class, Swish, Rio. They're so good. I'll show which these in a sec. The Melt Away Cleansing Balm. So makeup remover here comes in this guy. Oh, a sponge. We have so many sponges by them and they're all different shapes, sizes. See how it wedges at the bottom? I love, love, love these. That comes in here. The Diamond Shadow in Poison. Oh, we don't have time to open this, but we gotta look at it. The last one I got like this was super cool. I just tilted a little bit so it doesn't pour out. So this is Diamond Shadow in Poison, and a little bit goes a long way. You can use your brush or you can use a fingertip and literally tap it on. You can tap it out. Oh my gosh, it works so, so, so good. I'm not good at makeup, not a thing. I am a makeup virgin. Just really, really started diving in recently and it was easy for me to use. So that speaks volumes. And then what do we have here? Deep blue active colors. Okay, just real quick, we'll take a peek. Look at this. Okay, I think I can open it and it'll tilt forward without falling out. Can y'all see it right there? That is super, super deep blue. So that comes in this subscription here. A hand band in purple. The hand band is $3 and it's a new product launch. Oh, duh, okay. So when you're washing your face and doing your makeup, you put them here like this, you put this on and then put them up further actually. When you're washing your face and the water runs down, it stops, your sleeves won't get wet. So at the end of the day, let's say you haven't changed clothes yet, but you wanna wash your face, hand bands. Uh, you just woke up in the morning and you refuse to take your, rope off, your robe off and you wear your robe till noon, hand bands. And then last but not least, it's a bag of some sort. We've gotten some really cool makeup bags from them, but I thought I had already shown in that last video, the majority of the makeup bags. Oh, this looks like a travel bag. It is. So it's a nesting style. I use these for way more than makeup. One that's a drawstring. Two that's a hanging zip front. Three drawstring. Four zipper. Five zipper pouch. Six mesh zipper pouch. Seven, an even larger mesh zipper pouch. Eight, an even larger <laughs> mesh zipper pouch. So this is the brand new travel bag. It's $18, whoa, well, yeah. Oh my gosh, we got eight bags in one for $18. Yep, that is a very good deal. So here's my question. What came in the last subscription? Let me show you real fast. Okay, so this is the Sweet and Natural Lash subscription. It's $21 for five lashes. And this is what they sent this time. If you wanna get a concept for what they sent last time, just to kind of see if this is the style you like, make sure you go watch that beauty video. There are minute markers down below so you can hop around just to check out specific boxes. 
So that is sweet and natural, but let me show you this. These are the Flirty in Bold Lashes. It is $19.99 a month, and I believe you get four. And I think each of these, actually, the lash subscriptions come with a free gift. Um, these are like for the va va voom. If you want to go look at the ones we got last time, you can. The These are the ones I wear for like super extravagant fun. Those I wear more on a daily basis. I don't like a really big lash. These are new products they want you to know about, and that kind of gives you a concept because this is the big subscription. Prices are extremely affordable. So I highly nominate this for tweens, teens, 20 year olds who really kind of use a lot of makeup and have a lot of fun with their makeup. This is an excellent match. If you do subscribe to Lorella, hop back and tell us your thoughts, what you're thinking, what you have loved about them. You can add on products. Woo! Uh, what products should we add on to our next box? and grab that coupon code below to shop with. Whoo, that's only my second time to open that one and every time I'm open it, I'm like, oh my gosh. There is so much stuff, but it's fun stuff. So it's not like I can just hold it up and show you. I wanna open the palettes. I really wish we could play with the palettes live. Not that I'm very good at makeup, I'm not. Um, go to their Instagram. Their Instagram is awesome. The girl who, I guess she owns it, does her own like makeup and stuff on there. It is crazy cool what she's able to do. I will go to their Instagram and recreate the look she does with the palettes because I can't figure it out on my own and she's got good ones on there. Okay, this is a favorite of mine. This is Entry Envy. It is monthly. Entry Envy is a custom home sign system where you get refills of decor. So let me pop this photo up here. This is my sign. I have one that hangs at the front door of my house, one that sits here in my office, one that's out on the pink envelope playhouse. The sign stays as is. She custom builds them for you. Signs vary in price and they start at like 39 and go up from there. None of them are very expensive. I don't even know if she has many options over 200. They're very affordable and they're custom. But then each month she sends you a refill kit of the items you put inside. So I don't know if these are spoilers or not. I'll peek and look. The refill kits are $29.99 monthly or $34.99 seasonally, free U.S. shipping, two coupon codes for you. Pink can get you $10 off a custom sign with the purchase of a month-to-month -month subscription. Pink 20 gets you $20 off your custom sign with a prepaid annual subscription, but you also get two months for free, which is great. It's like over an $80 savings. And this is custom signage for your home and office with monthly or quarterly faux floral refill kits sent to you. Okay. So she designs multiple designs each month. This is what looks to be like my November. So it, I guess it could be a spoiler, but if she designs six, eight, or 10 of these, these are only two of the however many she designed. So I'm gonna show you real quick. On top, you get a picture and instructions on how to decorate. Very easy breezy. If you're whimsically like me, put it in however you want. If you prefer instructions, because otherwise it's overwhelming, do exactly what she says there. Then she sends you everything. Like it is super easy breezy. So everything is grouped. You don't have to figure out how to put it together. You just literally walk in and stick this in your sign. She sends you fresh, for, fresh moss that you can pin down at the base for each season. And I mean, literally, it's all just done for you. And you can stick it in. What is this right here? Oh, reminding people you can send a gift. You absolutely can gift. So um, assisted living. These are really great for assisted living because you can get a sign. You don't have to get the big sign like I did. You can get a smaller sign, a little bit like this one here. This is the one my daughters have at their bedroom. But she has even a couple different styles of this one here and do the quarterly refill so they get a, a holiday seasonal pool. You fill out a questionnaire, she finds out what you like and don't like so that the things she sends are appropriate for your sign. Um, and having it at the assisted living, it's just like an easy way to make things beautiful. You can do it for college dorms. She has hanging instructions, so if you're like a condo or someplace you cannot drill into the walls, she'll provide you the products and show you in a YouTube video exactly how to hang it. Very thought-free, very easy, very giftable, very, very giftable. Um, would be great for a parent, 
would be great for anybody who just got their first house, like a new ho homeowner. You could get it with their last name put on it, their monogram, their house numbers, whatever. Here is my second one I want to show you. One of these will go onto the front of the house and the other one will go onto the pink envelope playhouse. I haven't decided. Every month I just decide like in the moment which one's gonna go where. So look, this one's completely different. So this is all bundled together like this. We have our fresh moss and then this is what this sign looks like. And this is what they look like once they are hung. Once again, very easy. You pull the old stuff out. If it's damaged or messed up, you can throw it away. If it's not, you can save it in a little bin for other craft projects or to add next year. Now that I've had them over a year, I use my items from 2022 and put them in my 2023 to have like super extra over the top designs. And I will go in with these and I'll decorate as they're supposed to be. And then by the end of the month, usually my kids add their own little flair to it. <laughs> so it's been a while since I've done an empties review and only because my hauls at the beginning of each month, I do a monthly haul on the first of every month, have been huge. I'm like, we can't add empties in. But now my empties pile over here of things to review is getting huge. So we're just gonna go with it. You, do you need a drink refill? We are, I mean, are we, we're over 30 minutes in, we've gotta be. Uh, you can go grab a drink refill if you need to. I have, it looks way better than this. This is a used face mask, but this is the 100% pure face mask. If you remember, these were these full luscious face masks. I was so, so excited about them. You can see everything about them in that beauty box subscription haul that I linked earlier, or you can just go search it here on my channel, Best Beauty Subscriptions. So excited. A, the mask is so thick and luscious that I couldn't get it to lay down anywhere there's a curvature. So nothing was touching here. It Instead of it folding under and touching my chin, it kept flaring straight down. Is that a big deal? No, it's not a big deal. But I do like them when they can really like lay flat all the way across my face. Uh, I only tried one, the caffeine mask, because I thought, oh, that sounds invigorating. My skin was burning within 30 seconds to a minute. Now, I will tell y'all, and those who have been here know, I, I'm a fair-skinned redhead. Everything irritates my skin, literally everything. And then I'll hand it to my husband, have him try it, and he's like, no, I don't feel anything. So it very well could have been me. Um, the not laying flat on your face is going to be universal. The burning and singing, I have a feeling, is just me. Um, but I only got to try one of them, and I've been hesitant, and I haven't moved forward. Has anybody ever used the 100% pure mask? They looked so amazing. But now I'm a little nervous to move forward, so I thought I'd come check with you guys and see if anybody else had this experience. I will try it again. I never quit out the gate. I will try because I love face masks, they're such a detox. And then the second thing I wanted to loop back on was the Literary Book Club Halloween box. I don't remember. I think we opened it in our exclusive Halloween haul. So I will pick holidays, like I'm getting ready to do the Christmas haul. And all of the boxes in that video are products for that holiday or season. So this is Literary Book Club, an amazing book subscription box. I read the first book, we have always lived in the castle. I don't know how to review it. It was weird. The writing was so good. Like the writing, five out of five stars. Absolutely. The story itself was po not pointless, but kind of pointless. Like I kept like waiting for the hook or the thing to happen and then the book ended and nothing happened. Like I kid you not, that's what it felt like to me. It wasn't, I don't know, I don't know. It didn't have any kind of pull, but the writing was so good I wouldn't stop. So. Uh, I would, I liked it. I would say read it. I, it was good. I just started The Haunting of Hill House. You can see my little bookmark. I'm like that far in. Uh, so far, very good. Same author, Shirley Jackson. Um, but I, I'm not far enough in to like give a final review. But uh, I'll, I don't mind reading past it. But I don't think I showed y'all. Did y'all notice the spine was black? Like the pages are really cool on the inside. It's super, super spooky. Love the aesthetic, great for decorating. So, uh, the Literary Book Club special pop-up boxes. I don't think you even have to have a subscription to get these, you can just go order them, I think, from the online shop. Um, they're good, they're on theme. The products were on theme, the storyline's on theme. It is made building up to Halloween. 
amazing. So I can't wait to do the Christmas one next. They do have the Christmas book that builds up to Christmas with the gifts. If you subscribe to my channel, you'll be seeing that one because we're going to release it because it is, I mean, last year's was so good. And that concludes our empties. Just a couple I wanted to share with you. We'll do more next time. Um, and you'll notice some of these boxes I'm talking about are on that holiday gift guide. In the monthly hauls I release, I love to introduce new boxes, but I have to check back in on old boxes to make sure they're still as good as we thought they were. It's just kind of a dual in one. Let's do this guy here. Controversial box. Be Kind by Ellen DeGeneres. So I've been opening these. They just randomly show up in the mail. I never know when they're coming. I don't know who they're coming from. It is the weirdest thing. So this one just surfaced. Um, it is the fall Be Kind box. If you want to see past boxes, you can go up here. Um, I don't have a playlist or anything, but I'll link that one video just so you can kind of see what she's doing. These are Be Kind boxes curated by Ellen. They're quarterly at $54.99. They do offer prepaid discounts, meaning like if you subscribe for all four for the annual, you will not pay $54.99. You'll pay less than that. Uh, coupon code TPE20 is all they wrote. I don't know if it gives $20 off or 20% off or I'll update it before this video releases. TPE20 is going to give you something. Feel free to loop back and let us know what that is. Um, so she focuses on good for the earth, good for people, kind products and brands. It, irregardless of what you think, regardless, irregardless. Vote. Is it irregardless to what you think about Ellen? Or is it regardless to what you think about Ellen? I think it's the second one. I do this all the time. Y'all vote on that while I chat. Regardless to what you think about Ellen DeGeneres, the small businesses that she's supporting and the products are great. Um, and it's a great way to meet products for super cheap. And you'll see in a minute, usually the value on this box is very good. So here is a welcome letter. And it says, this box is making an impact with, and it lists all the brands that are in here that she is working with. You also get the Be Kind magazine, which talks about the products as well, how to's, coupon codes to shop on their websites and more. On top, we have charged jewelry with a story. Pearl Huggy hoops made thoughtfully with recycled acrylic. Well, they're very pretty actually. They're very lightweight. I am super into Huggies, although I have the hardest time getting them on. <laughs> I'm just really bad at it. These are a little bigger, so they will probably be easier, but very cute. We have a partake chocolate chip soft cookie. Y'all, these are so dang good. So, so good. Once again, kind of like I was talking about with Healthy Me, I can't order them and keep them in the house too often because I'll eat them all the time. But when they pop up in these boxes like this, it makes me so excited. Ooh, we have a face mask. I love face masks. That's why I was disappointed that other one was burning my face. This is a Thousand Roses Instant Soothe and Smooth Hydro Serum Face Mask. Very excited to try this. Although I'm not a rose fan. Not my favorite scent. Um, I'll still use it. By that same brand, we also got the Alpine Rose Stem Cell Mask. It does say this is for sensitive skin, which is really, really great for me. It says to use, apply a thin, even layer on clean face and let dry, leave on overnight, rinse off in the morning. Use once or twice a week. Oh, that'll make that product last forever then. Our Lavender Co. Lavender Roller Ball. Well, this is fancy. Look at the lid. I don't even know where to hold it because I want you to be able to see it. That is so pretty. I love things with great presentation and that has great presentation. Amina, I think that's how you pronounce it. Unicorn Dreams Body Oil. <laughs> that's fun. I'm going to smell it. What does Unicorn Dreams smell like? Oh man, I can't tell what Unicorn Dream smells like. Cotton candy-ish? It's sweet. It's a sweet smell. Cotton candy is what I would say, which is what most unicorn things smell like. But it has maybe a little bit of coconut in it. There's something that's not making it quite cotton candy all the way. You know, 
be a good time to pull this. Let's see what it says. Unicorn Dreams Oil, retail value $29, probably GMO free. There is a coupon code to order more directly from their website. Okay, I have to show you this. This is really confusing. What the heck? I think midway through, the pages are scrambled. This does not go with this. Does that make sense? So then if I flip it one more, this does not go with this. They got it shuffled in the printing because if you look at the beginning, uh, it makes sense. Like I'm gonna show you this product in just a second. These go together. So that's why I'm flipping back and forth with the most confused look on my face. I think I gotta do this. Yes, yeah, so this is the first page and this is the second page. So who wants to smell like cotton candy? That's a rhetorical question because the answer is obviously everyone. I got it right, cotton candy body oil. I also notice it says they are all about uplifting other women, which is why they donate $20,000 every three months to the 200 Muslim Women's Care, an organization supporting a slew of community fortifying nonprofits in the Tampa Bay area giving back in a great way, I love that. So then these two products, which I have to flip half to here and half to here, $5.99 value, $17.99 value. And these are proudly GMO free and have the coupon code. <laughs> this is crazy, I'm having to use magic. Our Lavender Co. retail value, $15. They also have a coupon code Clean, pure ingredients sourced from their fifth generation family farm. Love. Charged earrings, retail value $50. They also have a coupon code. We love a dual purpose product, which is one of the reasons why we're obsessed with charge. Oh, the pearls are removable and you can just wear it as a regular huggy if you want to. Well, I see zero information on the Partake bar, which leads me to believe it's a sponsored product, a promotional product that just got thrown in. Thank you, it's one of my favorites. Now I wanna show you this guy. Pure Life Biotics, retail value $15.99. These are steamers, and this one has four different steamers in it. The Breathe, the Calm Me, the Spa Day, and the Sleepy Time. Unwrap your tablet, place it out of the water steam on the ledge or on the floor, turn on your shower, wait to steam to build up, splash water on the tablet and it will activate it. I love these, love these. The bottom of my brand new shower is starting to get essential oil stains from me having these in here. I don't care, I want to enjoy it, I'm at peace with that. So there's four of them in here and I'm really excited. They're 100% all natural, organic and synthetic free which is important because I love fragrance, but I'm allergic to a lot of fragrance, i.e. the whole situation with the Hobby Lobby candle, like practically killing me. So I like clean, clean, clean ingredients. Okay, this guy here is another one where the pages are half and half. I actually don't know where the beginning of his product is. So I think this is, this is so confusing. <laughs> The Denik Lay Flat Notebook has a coupon code. Uh, Denik has funded seven schools, has a retail value of $11.99, and they are classic lay flat notebooks. So this is the pack of two with lined pages. So this is what one book looks like, and this is what the other book looks like. They have a bunch of different types of books. This is just the ones that's in here, an 80 lined page book. Very, very cute. Um, I don't know if I just got lucky, <laughs> but there's a second one in here that's super exciting. Okay, I set this right here, don't look at that yet. Mix books, rated number one. I've never made a mix book. I've always talked about it. I've even talked about doing the mixed prints. I've never done it. This might be the thing that pushes me over the edge. So, Mixed books allows you to create customized hardcover photo books. But then it also says here, we get a $35 book, a gift for Be Kind members. And so we can go online and totally order our own book. Oh, I'm realizing that I'm gonna have to, <laughs> gotta block the code so y'all don't go get my free book. 
So we get a mixed book. I'm finally going to try it. I want to make one for my teenage daughter so that she has all of her friends' photos in there. I think it'd be fun. And they always support an artist. Here is the art here. This is by Raggedy Tiff. The Raggedy Tiff art print has a retail value of $20. And there's a coupon code to shop more on her website that is ready to be framed. And then typically she has an artist do some things with the box. I wonder if she had an artist do this box. Oh, yes. It says meet your box artist. However, it says meet your summer box artist. And this is definitely the fall box. This magazine is all sorts of crazy. It literally says fall 2023 right here, but then it says meet your summer box artist. So I don't know if Jessica did this box. Maybe she did, maybe she didn't. But typically all the artwork you see on the outside is drawn by a real artist and printed on here. Oh man, all of my defense of it doesn't really matter how you feel about Ellen. The box is pretty cool. It's kind of, either way, it's a great value for the items that you get. Great brand you can be introduced to that you wouldn't otherwise be introduced to. That's why I share it on the channel. I never followed Ellen. I never got caught up in her stuff, but I know that these are real people who have real homes and real families that they're supporting. And I really do want to try to support them when and if I can. And this is a bang up value. So this is an easy way for me to support them in a very cost efficient way. I seriously cannot believe that book is printed like that. I'm wondering if I got like a sample, sometimes subscription boxes will print samples and then they'll send them to me and be like, hey, this is a sample so you can share it. But they include an email like that would say, hey, and oh, we're aware the booklet's printed crazy, you know, just don't show that or let them know we're reprinting. I've received nothing. <laughs> so that makes that a little bit weird. Okay. Where do we wanna go next? I think, oh, my scent bird. So I did officially just now cancel my scent bird subscription. The only reason I canceled it is uh, I got three or four back to back and I haven't even finished using the first one. Come to find out, I don't wear that much fragrance. And I thought getting the subscription would help me push through my fragrance quicker. And the answer is no. I even told my daughters, carte blanche, you can come spray it anytime you want. Wear it, whatever you feel like wearing it. And they were like, yeah. Well, they don't wear it either. <laughs> Apple doesn't fall too far from the tree, apparently. So I've canceled it only because we need to use what we have before we get more. So I do have the Skylar Fall Cashmere. So I did get my fall scent. It is this one right here, roasted almond, cinnamon bark, and spiced ginger. Uh, you customize your scents. They have a great scent profile. This is a really affordable subscription. Another one that would be very good for teens and tweens. It's monthly, bi-monthly, or quarterly, so you can choose your frequency. It is $16.95 for the fragrance refill, but you can get these really cool cases. I have one case and I rotate my fragrance in that one case. You don't have to do that. You can set up for each fragrance to have its own case for only $26.95. I was doing bi-monthly, so every other month, so I wouldn't get overwhelmed. Still is too much for me, but as a high schooler, I wore fragrance all the time and it wouldn't have been too much for me back then. So they have a lot more options. I don't have time to run through everything that they do with like their Saks Select fragrances, their candle subscriptions and more. But they do have um, prepaid discounts, free US shipping. And if you go down to my URL down below, you can uh, see what latest offers are coming up. But it is a fragrance subscription service whose mission is to empower every person to express themselves th through scent. So let me show you what it looks like. So you get this little refill with the top and then you have a little case that opens, I mean, kind of like a suitcase. You just pop it open, you pull that tube out, you put this tube back in, you close it around it and you're done. Easy breezy, super fast. Let's spray this in real quick. I think I can spray it without the case. It's just a little awkward. Yeah, it smells like a fragrance you would wear, but it gives off completely fall vibes. So I'm always saying this phrase, some of you agree with it, some of you don't. Wearing heavy perfume or fragrance into a restaurant's gross. I don't go to eat to have to sit by your perfume and taste it and smell it while I'm eating. I really despise it when people heavily cologne and perfume themselves and then go into an eating establishment. I think it's gross. This one, might be the exception to the rule because it smells like roasted almond, cinnamon bark, and spiced ginger. It's not like a heavy perfume smell. It's kind of wild, but yet it still definitely smells like a fragrance. So thumbs up.
I like this one. I have like all of them that I've gotten. Uh, they've hit my stock. Uh, speaking of scents, let me go ahead and show you this one. Addicted. Once again, after the whole kerfuffle with me grabbing that Hobby Lobby candle off the shelf, was super excited. I was trying to buy home decor and there was nothing to buy. Uh, so I just grabbed a candle because I had the itch to shop, came home, lit it, and thought I was getting the big C or the flu or bad head cold. After a couple days, I started catching the pattern that I felt fine at night and then horrible during the day, which is not normal, right? It was a candle. It was just full of crap and it was making me sick. It was so weird. So I swear to never, ever, ever again stray from my candle subscriptions that I know are healthy and tried and true and good and won't make me sick. So this is Vela Box, it's monthly. They have three box options starting at only $18 a month, $18 a month. Another very affordable gifting options. And they have gift subscriptions. They make it very easy, so keep this one in mind. Uh, free US shipping, $5 to Canada. First box is 50% off with pink envelope 50. And they are a monthly artisan candle subscription highlighting small batch and natural candle makers across the US. Take your scent quiz to receive the candles that match your favorite scents. So cute little graphic and welcome on top. You always get a free gift. We'll look at this in just a minute. Your candle always comes in a fancy smancy bag like this that you can reuse for a myriad of things. I primarily use them for like travel. Hair scrunchies, rubber bands, bobby pins, jewelry, earrings. I separate them individually into these bags. This bag is gorgeous. I got the Soy Much Brighter in Pumpkin Coffee. Soy Wax Candle, vegan and cruelty free, hand poured in Massachusetts. Ah, oh, this is gonna be a good one. I can already tell. So, gotta get that other scent out. I wanna smell this. The perfect pumpkin coffee. Like when you go, like, you know, to a downtown, like, a, find a small town, go to their downtown, and then pick up, like, that candle, little coffee shop candle. That's what this smells like. It is perfect. Pumpkin, black coffee, and vanilla. That smells so good. Uh, let me pour this guy out because it has all the information. So this is one of the three that they send out. And it's by the Soy Much Brighter Company. I have a coupon code here if I want to order more. This is the sweet and spice option of the three. And then um, this is the vibe. And then on here is the Spotify playlist you can play. And then these are candle rugs, a set of two. I have never seen a candle rug, but these are so cute. They look like your grandmother's like rug or an oriental, but this is grippy at the bottom. So you put it down, they don't slide, and then you can put your candle on there. So the heat doesn't go through to your tabletop. That's brilliant. So Vela, I've had a subscription to for years. Super recommended. I absolutely love their candles. I love the little free gifts we get. I love the Spotify playlist. It has been nothing but an amazing subscription to have on hand. And you can skip if you need to, but I mean, it's a candle. You, you can have candles pile up for a couple of months and then burn them. I've never made it that far. <laughs> I've never had a candle pile up situation, but I mean, if you're traveling, I can see where it happened. Excellent gift. Ooh wee. Okay, hold on. Gotta get some water. Let's go here next. Another favorite book subscription. So uh, Literary Book Club focuses on the literary classics. They do Jane Austen and in books like you saw that older Shirley Jackson book and then this sem a semi newer one. They're not sending out the newest latest trends over at Literary. Once Upon a Book Club is. So it's a subscription, you get both of them. If you like to read, you get both of them because they're not doing even remotely the same thing. Uh, literary is quarterly. This is monthly. It is only $34.99 free US shipping, but they do ship international if you're interested. TPE gets you 10% off your purchase. And Once Upon a Book Club brings books to life by giving you gifts that you can open as you read. 
gifts are customized to the book. And they also now have the middle grade edition. So this is the adult box. The adult box comes in two different themes. You can choose the theme that best matches your style of reading, but then they just relaunched that third box, which is the middle school box. And my daughter has opened it a few times. It's very good. This is the Halloween edition. So this is gonna be a great way for you to see what typically comes in one of their boxes. This is always on top and it's filled with goodies that you'll use for this over here. We have our bookmark and it's not called a book plate, is it? If there's signatures on it, the author's signature, a note from the author. And then this is more about the things that are in here. It looks like there's a, a game on the back here. Uh, I don't wanna look at this too much quite yet. I wanna pull everything out. So each of the gifts are labeled. So you open this on page 121. You open this on page 125. This one on page 336. This one on page 143. And then we have our book, which is so cute. My roommate is a vampire. I have read several of their books and I had one that I was like, that was, I don't know. I just didn't care for the style of writing and anything, but I've only had one. And I read most of it and just gave it to a girlfriend and I don't know what her thoughts on it were. Uh, the rest of them have been great. So I have a secret love for vampires. I have watched anything that's werewolf, vampire, especially if it's in the YA category. I've read it and watched it. I just love it. I don't know why. It's just a thing and it's real. So as soon as I finish that Haunting of Hill House by Shirley Jackson that came in literary, I'm going straight here. Uh, this makes a great gift for the reader in your life. It's a little more costly, but not bad. What did I say again? $43.99, so it's about a $50 option a month. So you can do like a single month, just gift a box, or you could do like a three month, six month, nine month. How much do you like the person? I'm gonna open these really quickly just so you have an idea of what a gift looks like um, in with the book. So these gifts tie into something that is happening in the book. So they might not make sense here, but they will once I read the book. So this is 336. These boxes are cute. I'm saving these boxes to wrap Christmas gifts in. Oh! Okay, well, what's gonna be the better way here? Let me pull this, this ring off. It's a ring. That's kind of crazy. Cassie's ring, ooh. I love it. It's super spooky. And does she fall in love with the vampire? Of course she falls in love with the vampire. So we have a ring. Oh my gosh, this is really cute. I don't know what type of bag it is. Oh, oh, don't drop it. It's in the shape of a tombstone. Oh, Cassie's purse. Please let this be a handbag. Stop right now, y'all. It's a handbag. I'm carrying this tomorrow. I'm wearing that ring and I'm carrying this tomorrow. Look at the inside. And then the strap goes on and you can be totally across your chest and hanging on your hip. Well done. Now I can't wait to read the book. Ooh. Oh, oh, well. wow. Is it a coffee mug? Y'all, this is the cutest, the cauldron mug. Oh my gosh. Look at the back of this. Is that like a part of the book? Ah, see, this is what happens. I don't ever open my gifts with my book. I always open them with you guys so you can get an idea of what comes in it, right? But then it gets me like super excited and like anxious to read the book because I've seen all the cool things and I'm like, okay. Is this a pencil set or is it a puzzle? I don't know. Very intrigued though. Note with a wax seal. Dear Cassie, for your, yours, Frederick, is that for your art, for your what? I can't quite read it and I don't know the storyline to put the pieces together. Maybe for your art, frameable puzzle? That's my guess, frameable puzzle. 
This one's actually wrapped like a gift. So I am literally opening a gift. It's <laughs> really exciting when they wrap them. It feels so special. Oh, colored pencils. I wasn't, I was, I was starting to lean more towards puzzle. A colored penciled artist set, set of 24. So I, is that not pretty hilarious that I read for your art? And I was like, oh, a frameable puzzle. I didn't say colored pencils. <laughs> ah, okay, anyhow. Okay, let me make sure I don't dump, dump these out. The box is very pretty. Oh, well, I already kind of dumped them, but that's okay. Let me roll them over so they're all in a spot. And voila, that's a very pretty box. I would actually take the black part out put these in with other colored pencils and store them in this box because that's cute. So there you go. It's a, I think a really good value for what you pay and what you get. The books alone have, this book alone has a retail value of $17. So if you're a reader or you have a reader in your life and you want more modern reads, check out Once Upon a Book Club. If you want more classic reads, go check out Literary Book Club. If you just love to read, read, do both. Oh, and I wanted to show you this. Uh, some of y'all are like, well, you just opened them all. How in the world do you know when to open a gift? The book literally is tabbed right where and when you need to read it. So you don't have to do anything. Even if you pre-open your gifts, you can then go get that gift and be like, oh, that's why they did that. It's brilliant. So yeah, it's all tabbed in the book for you. All right, next I wanna show you Project Home DIY. This is a tried and true box. I had so many of you guys asking to see this box and then we got it and we became addicted. So it is DIY home decor projects, meaning it's all home decor things for your home, risers, wall arts, etc. but you finish it out and she gives you all the supplies to do it. So it matches your home and you get a little crafting in. It is monthly at $49.99 and they do offer prepaid discounts. Free shipping in the U.S. and if you use code PINKENV30, you get 30% off your first box in the subscription. Project DIY focuses on quality, one-of-a-kind, home decor sent to you with everything you need to complete the project. You can join their exclusive and fun Facebook community once you are a member and projects shipped around the first of each month. Their community is really good. It's one of the stronger communities I think out there and they also will help you with your project. So she gives you written instructions, she gives you YouTube instructions, she gives you all the supplies. But if you're like, no, I still want more, you can hop over there and there's set like por portions of the Facebook group where you can like just talk about this month's project. So here is the, ins the inspiration for this month's project, which it looks like it's a riser and some decor to go on the riser. Here are all the written instructions with the QR codes that you can scan to get your instructions. And then in the box is everything you need to create your project. In your very first box, you get a welcome kit, which has like sandpaper and sand squares and paint and paint brushes and a paint palette and it was a ton of stuff. So if you're like, well, I don't see all everything I need here, that's because it's in your welcome kit, and which is over in the Pink Envelope Playhouse where I store all these things. So all of these pieces are pre-cut for you. You don't have to do any cutting. You don't have to do any insetting. But once you are done uh, painting, decorating, designing, you will then assemble accordingly with all of these guys here. Uh, Real Wood, on occasion, she'll substitute for something else as required, but almost all of her projects are made with good, real wood. I mean, you have to sand it, like a real craft project. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh my gosh, my daughters will love painting this. So you can paint it, and then it's a, it's a frame, put a picture in it. Isn't that cute? And then, what's in here? It looks like hardware. Yeah, all of our hardware that we need. So this gives you a good idea of the type of projects. Um, I'm gonna pop up some photos here to show you what this looks like when it's done because I won't have time <laughs> to do it here on the video. So here are some of the people from her private Facebook group in that community. They finished their projects and now they're sharing them with others and you get to see them here. And she has so many different types of projects. I couldn't even begin to tell you all the different types of projects she has. So go to her website and dig around and see some of the past ones. You even can buy some of the past ones. If you subscribe 
and then you go to shop, you get a huge discount on past projects. And that's always fun when you first subscribe. You'll go into your normal queue with these, but you can just go pick out your favorites and order them at a huge discount. And that's it. We reached the end. <laughs> that was a really good mix of boxes. Um, and I feel like we, in a somewhat timely manner, were able to kind of run through and show you all of those. Coming up next, we have Christmas stuff, obviously, is gonna start trickling in. And I have some stuff that I'm releasing exclusive on Instagram. I don't typically do that, um, but it's more like, I don't need a whole video, it's a little more snappy. So uh, I'll be sharing it here on the community tab and on Instagram and Facebook. So if you wanna hop over there, we're on Pinterest as well, but I feel like we can engage more on those platforms, whereas Pinterest is more like save and check out later. I don't know. Um, I have a brand new box. I'm not gonna give very many hints that's coming up. I'm hoping to release it in a couple of days. Might not be feasible, but subscribe to the channel because if it is feasible, my home decor entertainment people are really gonna love this option. And then of course, decor still still at boxes coming. Uh, Crate Joy sent me a pile of boxes and we're just gonna do a Crate Joy haul. Like just, just like we did here, less boxes and run through some boxes that they are saying make great Christmas gifts and that are a lot of fun and that are affordable. So that is coming also. I've got some book subscriptions. I've got clean, healthy living subscriptions. I've got the brand new Evergreen Lane winter box coming. Uh, we have a Christian subscription box haul. So subscription boxes that support Christians with either t-shirts or Bible studies or just cool swag. We have a, a lot of stuff coming. So subscribe so you don't miss that. If you want to go follow us on Instagram and Facebook, it's pretty much the same content across the two, but you can jump on both. Um, we post on there reminders about videos releasing. YouTube is where I hang the most. It's my, my, my family's here, but I hop over on those other platforms as well. And I'm able to show, Im share imagery easier there as well. If you're struggling on Christmas shopping, please go check out that gift guide. It's so cute. We worked so hard designing it so that it was really easy and efficient for you guys. And then of course, digging through hundreds of subscription boxes to find the ones that actually really do what they say they're gonna do so that you save time, save money, bring joy to your life or somebody else's life, which is key around here. I hope that you are having an absolutely amazing day. Happy November. And if you subscribe to the channel, I'm gonna see you guys later. Bye y'all.